The knowledge, the feel of the ocean. I just want to sit back and watch and enjoy. Yeah, uh, I mean, what do you say? Look at the style. Look at the rail work. She can see how much this thing's lining up. Look at the high line trim, almost like she's on a twin fin. And then she kind of just connects really easily with some pretty critical maneuvers there. So easily could have kind of bumbled and fumbled it. And then it doubles up. It kind of reminds me of Steph in Mexico. She just stands a little bit further up her board just to punch through that first little tube. Stalls, cuts off some speed, resets the line, and there she goes. Beautiful little tube all the way through the inside section, laughing her head off there. There was a bit of a trip up. And there they are, the two the, the two future superstars of the sport, for sure. In the mental eyes, here goes Caitlin Simmers now. She had a look at a wave earlier on, but she's going to make this one count. That all-important finish, she gets it. It's... I don't know where the judges are going to go with it. It's the first good wave we've seen from Kira, but Katie opting on a right. Wow, how's that peak? Simmers just taps into it, brings that tail right around, lining something up on the inside here, oh, wow. and she belts it. And I could see some numbers. It's going to be really exciting to see who gets the upper hand. Yeah, big opening carve first maneuver, just handles the wobble and bubble quite well, has to touch the face a little bit there to gain some more stability. As we take a look now at Katie Simmer, she already dropped an 8.33 and had another opportunity here. Yeah, loose and free over that top turn. Two stage down the face card there because she had to kind of readjust for the lumps. But I just like how quiet her upper body is, how deep she gets into that rebound as well. And effortlessly, she just does. She's kind of like John John. And here it is, Lewis. Just comes off the bottom and just goes for it on the first turn. But she's looking at this section right here. Look at the technique involved in that. She hit that so hard and everybody knows how hard it is to stay on your feet right there in that north section. Well, here's some replays, Bugs. Let's see what Katie did. Okay, Katie, another smallish wave, but she's really picking a wave here that's going to allow her to... Now here in Taiwan, they're coming together and uh, surfing internationally. Wow. So here on the screen, we're talking about size. Caitlin Simmers. <laughs> Beautiful whack off her front side and look at the speed that she's got wow how good is she 13 years of age she's still going here she might get another turn what a wave she's picked off an absolute screamer there and uh double triple overhead well katie simmers is having a look at this one she wants to be a four-time ush oh. usa surfing champion at some stage great re-entry to start off with and now looking so calm and collected as she comes through that inside section Starting to engage that rail. A little bit of S turns to gain some speed. Little hand drag to tail slide to finish. Long wall in front of her. Double pump bottom turn up into the lip. This time she lands it. It is finals day, six minutes on the clock. Quarterfinal number four for the women. And it is going to be the men coming up next. This is our current heat leader. Wow, Katie Simmers found this big set wave. And as she's been doing, really patient in the lineup. Looking to see if she can maybe get a little finish down in front of the rocks there. But you do need that experience. Let's watch this one, though. little check carve to start off. But this is where the score will come. Lovely. For now, that one fetched the 5-4 just short of the requirement, Brad. And Caitlin Simmons has the priority. And she'll use it to now up her 5-3-3 still sitting in her scoreline. Two-turn combo. Sparsy and sharp, as you would expect from the young American. Taking a look here at uh, Katie Simmers, a little inside runner, right hand, a big turn off the top there, you can see. Uh, but sometimes, especially in these conditions, that's not possible. So they are then going to go to higher scores if you do something exceptional. And exceptional surfing here from the young American Caitlin Simmers and also some good scores. This is the young phenomenon. Caitlin Simmers up and riding now. She surfs with so much maturity. You can just see how she releases that tail. I mean, effortless. Competitive history uh, of this venue. Caitlin Simmers during the interview had this wave bug. She's after a 7.67. Couple of nice spark. Uh, and Caitlin Simmers, she's going to have options. Uh, it just feels like with surfing like this, that she is going to be there somewhere at, thereabouts oh, wow. at the end of this year. She's going to hang on to another solid finish here. So this turn right here, Lewis. This is. CT level. Absolutely. Just flawless technique. She's got a little extra something that most competitors her age don't have. Well, here she goes. So, uh, 
Not with priority at the moment, but seeing some potential in this one. She had a six on her opening ride. And this wave standing up pretty nicely. Nice hit there. Into the float. The variation super That's solid. So a six on that first ride, which was... Here's a replay for Katie. Big drop in. Huge critical manoeuvre right up. High and tight in the pocket and plenty of spray to match the young lady. Stand out. Impressive performance from her. And I think a flex of maturity. Opting to sit out the championship to a spot this time round. I think I have a lot of time for that decision. I think that's a really good show of her. Malia Manuel and Nikki Van Dyke. Caitlin Simmons, Macy Callahan. They're forced to do the run around in that first half of the heat. Love the style of Simmons here as she dips into that first couple of hits and really finds a no nice end section to deal with. 4.83 on her last wave. As going in saying no to the qualifying spot. Having a look at that opening turn, what are your thoughts? This bit here, how she kind of pushes through her back foot at the end of that car. I really, really like that first. Super stylish. She hits it nice and early. Some of the greatest surfers in the world that have come out of that region where Gabriella Bryan has grown up from. But Caitlin Simmers, she's been in control. She's going under priority now. And into that pure bowl section on the left, on her backhand, and now that really smooth transition, gaining some speed as she makes her way through the flats. And starts to line it up on the inside section. And there we go. Oh, Ditches the fin again. That was incredible. Yeah, really incredible surfing from the young Oceanside local, Mitch. Where do you think this will sit in comparison to Courtney's opening waves? Well, similar? on the backhand. Beautiful two-turn combo and gets a third maneuver on the outside. But here, look, just cruising. She's like, yeah. Well, let's see if it glide right into this inside section. No worries. She's been fun to watch. Really, first how young she is, very poised in the jersey. Here's a replay. And again, okay, let's see her load up for this one. Off the top, <laughs> really cracks it. Wow. And again, she read this one really well, too. Waiting here, being patient, sticking by that white water waiting for this to bowl up on the inside, which we've been seeing all day. And here she goes one more time. Now here in Taiwan, they're coming together and uh, surfing internationally. Wow. So here on the screen, we're talking about size. Caitlin Simmers. <laughs> Beautiful whack off her front side. And look at the speed that she's got. Wow, how good is she? 13 years of age. She's still going here. She might get another turn. What a wave. She's picked off an absolute screamer there. But we've got some energy here coming in for our girls in the last minutes of the heat. Simmers, look at this wave comparatively to her size. Whoa. Up in the lip. Four and a half minutes to go. Oh, wow, that was wow. such a good turn. That was amazing. The 15-year-old phenom, Caitlin Simmers from Oceanside, California. She's had victory here in the past in the pro junior division. Now she is riding the shoulders of giants taking home the first win of many